Pokemon Unite has a problem. The game still feels like it was designed to last a month or two, collect some money, and then move on. Hi! For those who don't know me, I'm Chris. Let's discuss some things the game needs to really add some longevity for players. Number 6. Stop charging so much money for cosmetics. I mean, I get it. Unite is free to play, and they have to make money somewhere. If they don't charge $40 for Hollowware, where else would they get money? Besides, you know, battle passes, gotcha rolls, buying new Pokemon licenses and item enhancers, they have no other ways to make money. Sarcasm aside, I'm not against charging money for Hollowware, I just believe they should rethink the prices on them, since they're excessively high. I know I won't be buying them for those prices at least. Number 5. A mastery system for Pokemon. Uh, Pokemon Unite is not my first MOBA. I've dabbled in League of Legends and Dota 2, but the primary MOBA I played was Heroes of the Storm. And before I go any farther with this, I want to acknowledge that Blizzard is not the greatest company at the moment, and I want to make clear that I'm definitely not endorsing them, but they did do some things differently in Heroes of the Storm that I feel could be useful in Pokemon Unite. One thing that they and other MOBAs do is have a character mastery system. The way it works is, the more you play an individual character, the higher your mastery level in that character becomes. Once you hit a certain point, you can then buy a new skin that looks slightly different. This feels like an excellent opportunity for Pokemon Unite to introduce shinies for those who have mastered certain Pokemon. Number 4. Balance Update We all know that some Pokemon Unite are, or have been, how shall I put it, more equal than others. I think a large scale balance update to bring down the really strong ones and buff the ones that need it should happen. I know that balancing is an ongoing thing, but there have definitely been some Pokemon that need a little bit of a rebalance, and I hope to see that on a larger scale soon. Number 3. Scissor! No, just kidding. Or, or am I? Seriously though, we've been getting new Pokemon released pretty constantly, and they haven't been terribly balanced going in hand in hand with number four, of course. I asked you, the Zen community, how you feel about Greedent after the nerf, and most of you responded that he's balanced now. However, Greedent was way too powerful, and so was Sylveon before that, so maybe they need to test a bit more before throwing new Pokemon into the mix? It's also possible that they're releasing new Pokemon intentionally stronger to get more sales, but that's just me being a cynic. Anyway, for when they do release a new Pokemon, Scissor, please? Number 2. Matchmaking Rework I think people can agree that the current matchmaking unit is pretty bad. There doesn't appear to be any kind of behind the scenes MMR or anything like that, and you just kinda get thrown in there with whoever is available to play and who is the correct rank. There needs to be a rework of the matchmaking system to provide matches that are more fair to everyone involved based on skill level rather than rank. Number 1. New Maps Another major thing Heroes of the Storm did that I liked was that it had a ranked map rotation. Each one had a different unique mechanic. For instance, a map where you took over a giant plant and wreaked havoc on the enemy team for a short time, or a pirate map where you collected coins from neutral enemies and turned them in, which really feels similar to Pokemon Unite's current standard map to me. I think Pokemon Unite could do with more than one standard or ranked map in rotation, perhaps with different legendaries on the different maps, or different mechanics that do different things. Heck, they could even adapt their current quick play maps into bigger standard maps since they already have some different mechanics there. I'd just like to see some variation on maps and mechanics in standard or ranked. Who wouldn't want to rampage as Mewtwo for 15 seconds after all? These were my thoughts on what needs to be added or changed to the game to increase its longevity. If you want to discuss it with me, leave a comment, or join me in one of my live streams Monday, Wednesday, or Sunday, right here on YouTube. Bye!